morning folks how are we doing well seven degrees but chilly on the old mitts today basically come out this morning uh, i serviced the bike yesterday i did a quick video on it but it wasn't brilliant done oil change i went round there and had a good look at the chain because yeah i'll take you over have a look at this as you know my pet hates is having a crap chain you know full of grease lube rust and what have you you're probably not going to pick it up proper on the but since new this did chain has been horrific can't keep it clean can't keep the rust well yeah i can keep it clean just can't keep the rust off it now i've done everything i've emailed did not had nothing back whatsoever uh, it's gonna look like i'll have to just to bite the bullet and buy buy another chain get a gold one anyway it'll, it'll probably suit the bike better but it's poor form that isn't it you know what i mean it's not like i don't look after them i really do look after chain as well and uh, no matter what i do just can't keep that rust off it but hey anyway, oh it's what happens in it but yeah i give the bike a service yesterday uh put some oil in it done the chain went round everything done all the crankcase breathers tyres are brand new up pads are fine so it's good to go now and it's all set up for winter but i've not rode it since now i've just rode it to here then <laughs> it don't say i feel better but you're not sure if that's in your mind are you you're not sure if that's in your mind but here is low on fuel so i'm gonna put some fuel in it now anyway roll that intro i'm not really what are you joking <laughs> i'm not rolling nothing <laughs> <laughs> I hear all other vloggers say, you know, they always want to say it. I'm not doing that though. <laughs> Roll it! But no, no, we're not rolling it. We're not rolling no intro. What we might do is I'll drop it back here because the ground's poor. But no, we're alright. We're alright. No, but uh, i done the service yesterday. Just after I'd finished it, it was drizzling with rain. So I didn't get a chance to, uh, to try it out. But I don't know, sometimes I think you think it's in the mind, don't you? Oh, who knows? Who knows? It does feel better though. Auto blipper. <laughs> For poor people. Them two women, I looked in the mirror there, I could see him looking behind. I passed them before up there, they've made some ground then. I just looked there, she's looking behind then. Oh. Probably thinks I'm up to no good. But yeah, uh, the fuel light's actually gone off, the fuel light's been on. But it's, it, is due for, it is due for coming on now at this point. It was on the other day, but... You're all right, mate. Don't worry about me. Could have made life a lot easier for both of us if you'd have just let me out. That'd have been too easy, though, wouldn't it, buddy? That'd have been too easy, that. Feels a lot smoother. As I said, I'm not sure if that's just in the mind or not, but it does feel a lot smoother. Oh, there's the fuel light. She's there. New wouldn't be long. Couldn't get a bit of lotion in it. Phase open, get out tomorrow and do a bit of the old manoeuvring. Weather's not forecast brilliant, but she needs to get out either way. No, honestly, the bike feels loads smoother. Now, I don't see how that can be just with the oil change, but you never know. Oh, 
horses. Let's go to the clutch in and we'll creep past. How cute was that little horse then? Oh, look at all this crap on road. I wash bikes over there. Look at this. Eh, it's all that about. It's only an adventure bike. Don't think I didn't do it, eh? <laughs> no, it was uh, <laughs> not washed in phrases. I done man affairs last week. Oh, this is definitely smoother, definitely. I've got a great imagination, but it's not that good. No, the main reason for this ride out today was just make sure there's no oil leaking. I don't know if you do, anybody does their own servicing on one of these, or any other bikes. But, in the book, the oil filter, if you talk it up uh, to spec with torque wrench, I think it was something like, I can't remember, I think it was like 22 newton meters, which is it's pretty tight for an oil filter that. Like I'm going to when like oil filters, you put it on, put a rag on and, and give it a good anti, you know what I mean? And that that were plenty. Uh, but it said 22 newton meters now. I, I did it to spec, put torque wrench on it. Yeah, put torque wrench on it. And it was like tight, I took your link hang on. If I'd have been doing it on my own, just off off feel, and I stopped way before what the the spec was. And then the sump plugs with crush with crush washers on. They were only like four newton meters more. Now when I was doing that, you thought if I'd have been doing that off field, I'd have probably given another, I don't know, another dad tight, as they say. I'd have probably made it dad tight. But I don't know. Do you remember when you never used to use salt wrenches and that back in there? I see I come from a proper rough council estate mate and uh, it comes to fall get bikes or car service that dealers it just it's just not happening see uh, a lot of time you just you know the Haynes manuals you used to always get them for your Mark II escorts and that and the old thing of having loads of bolts left over oh you used to do that again your points and condensers rotate it busy cap gain it right that blue car waited till the very last minute you whopper absolute whopper there's been signs all the way down this road saying that lane were closed and he waited till the very last minute unbelievable at the auto blipper We'll get a bit of Tesco's finest. Oh, hell. oh they've got a got pumps closed. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. 
Oh, I think we'll have this one here. Look at that. He'll do us, won't he? That'll do us. Well, we are down to a 58 mile range. It's got a pretty old big reserve on this. I'm not going to brim it. Uh, just get enough in it. Anyway, folks, we'll see you in a bit. Well, folks, that's us. I wasn't going to bring it, but I thought I would. Over winter, when it starts getting cooler months, I start putting, uh, start putting premium stuff in. It's 99 octane, this. It's just less to turn into water. makes the fuel harder to burn, all the rest of it. It's any little helps, don't it? Not only in over winter, because there is times when bikes stood up for a couple of a couple of weeks, two or three weeks. Because I'm riding out me, but just not frost. Can't be doing with the frost. But we've now got a range... I don't know you can see the 334 mile range. I say I'm off work today, it's my rest day because it's, uh, it's my Saturday in. Servicing it yourself. You can touch hands on everything, all bike car, you have a good look round and. The stuff you notice is unreal, like when I done this yesterday, even though this bike's always spotless. Took the sump guard off on that, you should have seen it underneath. <laughs> it was terrible, it was terrible. So I'll give it the, the old once over. A few people have mentioned them Daytona Lady Star boots for fair. Now I think we are going to go down that path, so good call, all you that mentioned it. I've not heard a bad thing, I've been looking into it now. And uh Obviously, which is a pillion, it doesn't matter, does it? But now she's getting her own bike and being vertically challenged. Every little helps. So she says. The idea, I know the idea, bloody hell the idea. But I suppose they do wear well, so it could be the last boots she buys. Could do with somebody buying some and packing and biking and flogging them. Keep looking on eBay, but there's not there's not many second-hand ones. Oh, there's that little horse from before. Anyway, wrap this up now, folks. Just want to make sure the bike was all right. Oh, it's just hit 10,000 miles, though, and you can see it, folks. Oh, I'll try and get that. Oh, whether you can see that there, folks. The old 10K. Most of that's done this year. <laughs> oh, it shows you, doesn't it? That should have been about 14, 15k now, but with with you know, these lockdowns and all the rest of it, it's it's hampered stuff. But there you go, it's all in the bank for next year. It's got brand new tyres on, it's serviced, it's ready to rock. Anyway, folks, thanks for watching this again. Really do appreciate it. If you could like, subscribe, it does help the channel grow. Like I say. We don't do Patreon or out, I know there's ads, I know these ads are taking the uh, Michael a bit now, aren't they? We don't have out do with that, YouTube put them up. We, we allow ads just for can try and get a couple of bob in, and I mean, ask anybody, it is a couple of bob. Honestly, it's ridiculous. If we had patrons and that, and was get, I was getting a couple of quid a month, I'd, I'd rag the ads off, I really would. I'm not that, I'm not into it to make a load of money out, uh, but if it pays for the odd SD card, why not? Why not? Anyway, folks me rabbiting on for too long anyways it is so get in get kettle on warm up it's 8 degrees now warm up and uh, I'll speak to you soon see you later